competition was fierce out here at the Whispering Pines Golf Club in Trinity, Texas for the Big 12 Men's Golf Championships. The first ranked Texas Longhorns took home the hardware for the fourth year in a row, but that did not stop their competitors from giving them a run for their money all weekend. The top ranked Longhorns topped the record book, shooting 15 under on day three, the best in Big 12 championship history. They finished their weekend 26 shots better than second place Oklahoma State, and four horns completed the weekend in the top 10. They played spectacular golf today. Uh, 67, 68, 69, 69, 72 was incredible golf on this wonderful golf course. It's very challenging, and so uh, first of all, their, their golf was spectacular, but what was really good was the strength of the Big 12 this year. We knew coming in we would have to give it our best golf and, and, uh, or play our best golf, and, and uh, today we did. On the individual side, things were neck and neck going into the fourth round on Sunday. Texas sophomore Bo Hostler and TCU's Paul Barjan each finished the weekend five under, but it wasn't enough. Oklahoma State's Strat Nolan clinched the win by one shot after birdies on holes 14 and 15. When I made that putt, I knew that was going to I mean, getting me to six under, I think, at the time. And I just thought that was going to be a pretty tough number to beat. I mean, did I think I had it on 15? Probably not, but I knew I was putting myself in the best position. The champions know how tough it is to win in the Big 12. And while they may have finished on top this time, they know the conference will only continue to improve. We're just so fortunate to, to win our fourth in a row. I don't take it lightly. I don't take it for granted. And I, I know how tough the Big 12 is. Everybody in the Big 12 is good. So, I mean, there's a lot of really good players. And it just, I mean, to come out on top like that, it's, it's something special. It is unreal. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Christine Williamson.